going to turn that down. What you're listening to is my friend Adrian Lambert. Um, she just put out a, a like a double album. Um, it kind of came out of the loop, and uh, part of it is just instrumental stuff. Um, here it is. I got it in the mail yesterday. to a camp in the Berkshires right as soon as COVID hit and um, with a friend and she said like 48 tape machines and a bunch of them died and they had a lot of trouble getting some getting power and whatnot and everything working out in the woods but so they would record during the day and then they I guess there was a stream they would bathe in or something, and there was just no like. Uh, I guess there was electricity of some sort. Somehow they managed that, but it's pretty rustic. And anyway, she said, um, like at nighttime, they just record instrumentals. So one of them is like songs she put together, and one of them is all instrumentals. And that's what we listen to is her instrumentals that they put together, and the background sounds and the nature. It's really, it's really pretty, really beautiful recording too. So, how is everybody? Um, did you check? Oh yeah, so, um, it's funny. So this finger's good, the one I cut, but from not using, playing guitar much, my, there was just this whole pinky callus peeled off. It was just a huge chunk of skin. So hopefully that's not too gross, but it really is, it's just like, it's super raw. So it kind of sucks. Um, but next week we should be back. I'm gonna keep playing. Um, having fun playing this 12 string trying to avoid songs with um pinky being used but uh well hell i did have some notes oh here they are i feel like playing a neil young song to start so there you go And as always, you can write down uh, anything you know you all want to hear. Um, I, do, I do have a pretty good list of songs today. Top of the game for once. Hope everything sounds okay to you guys. As always, if something sounds funky, you know, just let me know if it's too quiet or it sounds like it's breaking up or it's too loud, all that's really good feedback for me.
Yeah, that's who I was talking about when I first started. Sorry, I probably only said her name once. Her name's Adrian Lenker. Um, I don't know if you, if you missed the beginning. I thought I saw your name here. But, um, yeah, so she just put out this record she recorded in uh, Western Massachusetts. Uh, she's from the band Big Thief, who's uh, quite a, well, they're one of the more known indie acts around the world. And um, she's just an absolute talent, very multifaceted guitar player, singer. So Adrian Lincoln, A-D-R-I-A-N-N, Lincoln, N-N-E, Lenker, L-E-N-K-E-R. She's got a few solo records. And I highly recommend it. Two wine glasses, I'll get to that. It's on a different guitar, Derek. Need a, I don't want to switch too quickly here. Hey, here's one of mine, another one of mine. I have to do that on the, I could maybe do it on this actually. It'd be... I did have a version on this guitar. It's tuned a little bit lower, but um. Ah, uh, uh, shit. I'll try it. I'm, I don't know. How'd it go? It was like a. Already. I haven't even finished the first one. Here we go. My young lady, love you, I turn your lamp down low. So much lately, travel far, I ain't got a thing to show. But I got two wine glasses and one bottle.
short. I feel like I cut some out of it, but well, yeah, you're welcome, Derek. I'm happy to do it. General Stroll, I'm gonna kick that one down a little bit. I only got so many songs that have such a good backbeat and a little bit of funk to them. I don't wanna do them all in one shot. That sounded good on that 12 string. Yeah, I gotta find a, well, my pinky hurts. It's not as bad as it was last week, so. It's not that mini party. I know. <laughs> It's not, it's not like a, a razor went into it. It just feels like some stuff in it with a pencil when I play it. Too, but I gotta get practicing again after this, so. Um, my own fault. Um, I wanna do this song. This is one of my old ones. Let me cheat a little, okay. When the last time I played this. We got straggler. Two of them. Oh, okay, hold on. We're gonna just we're just gonna go for it. Sounds like that last one can really give a beating to some of the certain strings. Okay. This is off my record, Final World. Yeah, I don't name my guitars. I just, I just I don't know why it, it, it bugs me when people do that, so. I probably named my first one with some stupid like Blackie because that's what Clapton named his, you know. It's only Told me twice, you told me 
Sounds okay to the... Yeah, excellent. All right. Um, I do have... I don't know if it's pinned on everybody's page. I really don't know how comments work because I don't get a lot of the comments sometimes. For instance, I know you... Oh, I guess I did get Nick Ween. Hi, Nick, if you're still listening. Um, but yeah, I don't... Sometimes they just don't don't come through. Um, let's go back. Yeah, he was riding home from the studio, so he may not be doing comments. Oh, right, right, right. I guess my point was that I put my my PayPal stuff easy click, which is right there, slightly out of frame, I'm noticing, but you get the gist, I'm not gonna mess with it. Got a bunch of big ass magnets on there. Um, but anyway, it, all, it, it helps. This is right now about uh, half of all the income I make during the week. Lucky to have Treaty Oak, so, and that's, that last week was pretty damn cold. I don't know, I don't know how long those are gonna last. I'm just hoping that they, I don't know, that just warms up, it stays warm, but, hi mom, um, hey, I want to play a, a Nick and Paige song, Reverend Free, it's track two off their record, um, I, I really like the song, I think it's a perfect COVID song, to be honest, it's called Nothing Else to Do. And I learned it a while ago. I, I just had to relearn it over from my old YouTube video, but it's up there anyways, a few years ago. So this is, a, again, a reverent few song called Nothing Else To Do. They just put out a record. Um, you can listen on Spotify and everywhere. Or you can buy the vinyl. I have got that I think it's, it's tough being in a band right now and if you like what you hear from them too you know it's a couple clicks away good music too early for love too early for love the stars start shining the stars up above and there's nothing else to do there's nothing else to do the cars are all empty streets are all bad Perhaps I'll be sleeping in a bed to share, but there's nothing else to do. There's nothing else to do. The time is still, and I've been reaching for thoughts to burn through the night and forgetting what I lost as I think of you. Nothing else. For a little bit too. That's on a different guitar. Um, I don't want to do that one on this one. I do another couple on here. You know what I'm gonna do is the pattern actually. 
I remembered that I had mostly written it on here in a whole different set of chords that I that I, then I play it in. And so I refreshed those chords. So I think I'll get it. We'll see. Keep you guys on your toes. It's always uh, uh oh. Is, is is your video freaking out? Mine is. Sometimes I think it's mine. Yours isn't? Okay. Mine, I'm like doing a max headroom thing. <laughs> no, it's all cool. <laughs> Can you see it? Just kind of flipping out. Oh, no. Mine's okay, good. Mine's all right. Got his own tail in his mouth And when will we learn As history goes on repeating The pattern been burning through the fabric that far James, as soon as I saw your name, I knew we'd be doing that song tonight, which I'm happy to do. It's always fun to do newer ones. Uh, man. Um, yeah, I'm going to switch guitars in. I'll, I'll do a... Uh... Oh, I don't even have my... I don't even have my... I didn't break out my six string. Uh, that's okay. We'll use this one. This is, uh, I bought this one six, seven months ago just to, um, to take this out of it. And, um, it was such a cheap deal, but I actually really like this guitar. It's my one for sitting in the sun with. I always need a beater to twist up over a few years. So... He's uh, here's one for my mom, Underwater Dream. Hey. 
has super high action. Lordy, lordy, what am I gonna do? Well, um, I'm not gonna play piano, no. I'm actually, uh, it's a little, uh, it's out of tune again because I left it for so long. And instead of doing it myself, I'm actually I'm getting, I, I contacted, uh, got a couple of recommendations and contacted somebody. And I'm hoping to just have it done professionally, just at least once, because I didn't even do these keys. These are just horrendous at tune. See this? Like, I just, like, listening to that was just insanity. Like, I mean, it, there's three strings in there. Ugh, I hated it. And these lower ones, I just can't. It might have something to do with the scale length of this piano being a small piano. I might, it might not be possible to actually have it all kind of plain sync. So, um, no, I'm not going to play piano tonight. Um, no, but this doesn't sound like Yoko Ono's piano. Yeah, I mean, I've got, the stuff I did, I did okay with. I mean, I did, I did like, I did, couldn't, I couldn't get to the last half an octave, and I just can't get to the two ends. So, um, that's that. We'll do that from the wreckage, the newer song, and maybe I'll use this. I'm gonna try that guitar. Yeah, uh, that's the one I brought to Buck Dancers in. I feel like they gave it back and didn't do anything. I hate to say that publicly, but that's kind of what it feels like. Um, strings are super high and it doesn't tune well, so um, and apparently people don't like to do neck resets on these guitars, which means, as beautiful as it is, and it sounds amazing, it's, it's just can't tune. Not for, but the, 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 to record this thing with a mic is like the shit. Oh man, and I don't even have my shit, my sound hole. I don't even know if this thing works. It's in here. I guess we're gonna find out. I'm not hearing anything. Either way. I don't know why. Is it 
two jacks. I don't know what's going on. Okay. That banjo tower right there, that's it's it is appealing. It's appealing at this point. I'm gonna have to use that. Yay. I'm not gonna use the banjo tower. I, I, I think I just got it from Ben Jones, who had it since I've been gone, and um, I don't know. I was messing with it, but it needs a little TLC. All right, I'm gonna just have to bust it out on this. So, as I said, every week I do get a little bit more done um, with my new recordings I'm working on. This week was more fussing with hardware and software, and I had this huge plug-in suite, which is, it's all just, whatever. I just had to update that stuff for the last few days. And these companies, don't make anything easy. So, new music soon. But I'm not gonna say how soon.
you guys. Um, James, uh, I gotta. I can't. Excuse me a little bit here. Well, thanks, James. I appreciate that. And uh, I gotta say, I appreciate you. Uh, your name's always in the uh, in the tip in the tip jar, and I. I mean, I can't tell you how much I appreciate that. That's, you know, I'm always happy to play whatever you want. Um, I'm happy to do it anyways, even if nobody sent me anything. But still, it, it does uh, makes it a little, little, little bit easier to to, uh, to change my um, uh, to to change my direction when I'm in the middle of this. Nick Lean, Adrian Lanka, A D R I A N N E and at the end of it, like Annie. Um, well. I kind of want to do something I've never done, or I used to do it a long time ago. I gotta, I gotta get the twelve string back though. Beatles song. I'm in a Beatles mood. I'm wearing my Beatles butcher shirt and some festive socks. Whoops! Again. All right, here's a, here's a Beatles song, and I'm gonna and hi, Carissa. Oh, uh, Carissa sent me a heart. That's okay. Luke sends me X and the O, so I guess you both even with each other. to know that. Yeah, maybe for a few That's a good show. song. That's a great song.
I don't know, it's a long time ago. That was one of the first songs I used to attempt, probably horribly. Yeah, I mean, it's got some, some changes in it. But, uh... Yeah. Um, the Wood Brothers do a really killer version on, like, there's a oh, live really? version of them, yeah. Oh, wow. I don't know, it's, I don't even, I think it's on, like, just some random release, like a Spotify or something release, you know. But it's really good. Great song. Um, where are we at with, uh, John Stewart playing? Oh, so, cool, I'm, I'm back Somebody to ask if you ever played with Spencer on Beatles tonight? No, he's never asked me. Dave shared the zero grams of sugar. Somebody says a John Prine song. I think you have one John Prine. How many grams of sugar are in that drink? Dave yeah, I see that. I just said um, zero. If you want to get together and crush some hard seltzers, Dave, I'll show you the ropes. <laughs> um, here's a, this is one of mine. Now that we're doing the, the drop D on this thing. John Prine song. I only know the one, Carissa. Mom wants love is all I am. Um, yeah, I can do that. Thanks, Dave. Um, yeah, the Wood Brothers do kill. Maybe I should do a Wood Brothers song. They're like the best 
band going. My socks are great, thank you. You're you're right about this. Dave Dave knows me. Perhaps better than than most should. Um You know, I still, I gotta do, a, I don't know if he's still on here, but I'll do our general story that Derek asked for a long time ago, because I'm, I'm already in that tuning. Um, no, you know what, I gotta cheat, because I keep forgetting one part of one verse, and it's driving me crazy. I just haven't been out playing these songs, so it's easy to forget them. Mine. I gotta label it better. This is the before it. It's in the G's. that one um that song is a masterpiece oh thanks it is i don't, I don't know it's about that it is it's really superb so carissa i don't know i don't actually i mean i kind of know luckiest man but it's just not what i typically play let me do a um let me grab a wood brother song from the ether here i just can't there's a ton I play. I can't think of them. Ten men. Oh, I don't want to do that. That's all. 
That's actually oh, a, that uh, that's a yeah. that's a David Mallet song, but oh Mallet, oh no, that's not. Mallet. Yeah, I want to. Uh... Actually, this is a good one. This one's called Loving Arms. Whatever it is, and then I guess uh, guess I can do the Love Is All I Am after. I can't play the David Mallet song today. I need to, uh, I really do need to, um, I need to practice it and um, all, all the skin came off my pinky and there's tons of pinky and it's on a 12 string and it's, it fucking hurts. <laughs> but I do need to just learn that, that song, relearn it again for the seventh time. It's a dicey one, it's a hard one to do. This one's called Loving Arms.
just miss all the love. There goes. Which one? A hat? One hat song? No, the song I know by uh, Carissa, the only song I know by David is uh, 10 Men that when I recorded and put on that EP that's up online. Hi, Roger and everybody. Good, well, you guys helped me to get through the pandemic. And Karen gets free sh one free show a week. Yep. Um, she's been really nice. I don't, I don't know for sure. If she's uh, if she would re up on me every single week, but <laughs> I, <laughs> it would be I, nice. Somebody else came in here. I was thinking today. I mean, it, we have many really dreary overcast days, and this is certainly the right spot today. Nice. I just remembered. I know another Wood Brothers song. We've never gotten to the point where I think if he plays that song one more time, I'm going to cut myself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm aware of it. I do try not to play like the same ones every time. But, but no, that, that's great. So I just, I come in with songs I haven't done too often because I, you know, the typical songs always come up, so it's fine. But, but you, you, you change them up. And I'm trying to. And so it's just, they sound fresh every time. Well, thanks. But Karen's just being nice to me because you guys are all listening. It's like uh, it's like it's like Stephen King's in misery here most of the time. <laughs> Where's my sledgehammer? <laughs> I hit it. That's what happened to your finger. I can't. I hit it. I can't take any more sledgehammer. Um, here's a, this song's called "When I Was Young." Thank you for everybody who's throwing a couple bucks towards my survival fund. It uh, does make a big difference. And um, uh, yeah, what the hell with it? Hit another Wood Brothers song. I just feel like doing it. And I don't think I've done this one on here. It's actually, uh, so I'll, I will say, I love their lyrics and their music is insane, but I can't do it on the acoustic. So I just took the music from Don't Do It by um, the band and kind of used that a little bit. It just was easier for me. I just, I can't, you'll hear, once you hear, go listen to When I Was Young um, by the Wood Brothers. I mean, it's just absolutely crazy. It's just such a jam. It may take three instruments to pull this thing off. So anyways, this is um this is kind of my version of one of their songs. When I was young I didn't look at the clouds and hope for the rain. When I was young I didn't think this life would ever bring me sorrow. Someday everybody gonna know my name When I was young, the hardest work I had Was wait for tomorrow When I was young, I used to wake up early in the morning When I was young, I used to climb up a mountain Didn't matter how tall And when I was young, I didn't listen to anybody's warning I was young, I could jump, and I wasn't afraid to fall. But now I'm grown, and things are not exactly what they seem. The older I get, the less I know, and the more I dream.
I didn't believe I'd ever be a man Now I'm grown and things are not exactly what they seem I think about God and I want to know to think about me Doubt it My take on a Wood Brothers, Leo Kaki. I do not know <laughs> Leo Kaki, Christ. I learned like one song of his. It's the very first one I ever posted to that, to my other YouTube channel. Actually, no, I didn't even learn a song. It was the first 13 seconds of the song called Too Fast. I'm sorry. I, mean, I wish I could play some Leo Kaki. I could learn bits and pieces, but that guy's just like, a, I mean, he's a master. I guess I got some more songs. Um, my pinky, the pain, the pain stat is just be like this dull. This dull pinch, so it's not so bad anymore. Wait until you start to get stigmata. It's all like red. It looks like a little cherry. That'll, that'll, be, that'll be cool. Stigmata? You know what stigmata is? People that are so um, religiously obsessed or whatever, they start to bleed from their palms like Christ. What? Yeah. For, for real? It, you know, some, it's they some, make it. They make themselves it's, do it's it. It's like a somatic phenomenon. Yeah, it, it happens. Christ. Oh yeah, big house. That's right. I forgot. Um. Okay. Do that one. Jolene's uh, singing along. Yeah, I hear. She can sing all day. The barking is where I. Uh, With that sharp little voice. Starts to sound like. Like Sammy Hagar or something to me. <laughs> this big house is gonna make you lose your mind. This big house gonna do it to you every time. Every time I open a door, it's a room I've never seen before. And every time I turn. Final World Part 1. Ah, oh, it's all pinky. I'll do it though.
from her face But you feel you need a little bit more See what you have before it's shown to the floor It's such a strange, such a funny, such a crazy old world Such a lovely, such an ugly, such a dead old world Such a dirty, such a lazy, such a mean old world It's such a very, 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 very fine world There, that was part one, I think it's a simile of it. Nice. Well, um, I think I'm caught up. So I guess I'll do, um, my mother asked for love is all I am. Beautiful song by the band Dawes. And I think I'm going to call it at that. They have a song called A Little Bit of Everything that's a great song. Yeah, it's a good tune. It's, uh, it's a little more involved than I think I ever want to get. Marvin Dykus plays that. Got, I yeah. love his voice. He's got such a good yeah, voice. I remember hearing him play it. I was, on, yeah. I was, I was in, on the same stage with him. We were, I don't yeah. know. What, it might have been for a gospel brunch when it was held at... Um, at Strange Brew. Yeah, I think yeah. I was one of them and he was one. And I just thought it was so... I was like, I didn't... I've been trying to turn my fan, friends on to Dawes for like ever, and it was when they only had a couple albums and nobody knew them. So it was like, oh my God, this guy actually knows this. Yeah, I didn't but, until he sang that song, and that's when I looked him up because I thought, wow, what a great yeah, song. Yeah, it's, it's a good tune. It's, it's, such a, it's almost a theatrical thing. Yeah. You know, it's a good number. But even this song is long as shit, so it's, it's, it's a commitment, you know. Yeah. But that's all right. Guys, thank you so much for hanging. Thank you for everybody who's threw uh, some money my way. Um, yeah, I'm not pretending like that doesn't matter. Um, we get a piano tuned. I'm hoping he's not expensive. Dave Scher gave me a good recommendation. He hasn't given me a number yet, though. But I'm guessing it's going to be a couple hundos. Hopefully not. Probably, though. I wouldn't want anything less than tuning somebody else's piano. It's such a pain in the ass. Um, I gotta get it tuned though. I really I gotta get the low end and the high end done. I just can't do those. I wanna use it for some recordings coming up. And uh, blah blah blah. Anyway, oh, the, that's the other thing I wanted to tell you. Uh, so my CD release is next week? No, on the 10th, right? 10th. Two weeks? Okay. Halloween two weeks? Halloween is, two is next Saturday, so a week and a half after that. It's in, in the middle of the week, right? Tuesday-ish, Wednesday, Tuesday? Wait, no. It's it's on a Tuesday. So oh, okay. it's either so one it's week or two next, weeks away. Not, next week, it's the week after. Okay, okay. Then, well, we're going to have, I'm going to do it outside at Nick and Pages. They're going to help me with the sound. And I'm going to have uh, David Jimenez and um, Ben Jones play. And if you're in Austin and you want to come personally, there should be, it's a pretty good sized lawn. So there's plenty of room for people to like spread out. Um, so we're considering that. I'd say hit me up personally if you really want to go. Um, but we're not even sure if it's too cold. We'll probably just end up doing it. Have to just do it inside with just a few of us, not with like a crowd or anything. Just literally Nick Page and me and Ben and um, Jimenez. I think is what's going to happen. It's impossible to say, but it could be really balmy and warm. And yeah, if it's a nice out and it makes sense, then totally we'll do it outside. And it will probably be. It'll probably be around seven, I think. She, she didn't get back to me today because of the. Uh, but oh, we have lights on the porch. Yeah, there's lights. There's, well, they'll all work out. Yeah. Um, I just afraid if we push it up earlier that I, I'm pretty sure he doesn't even get home from work till 5:30 or something like that. Oh, okay. You know, we'll need that time. So, but I'll I'll, I'll get on that. So anyway. Um, yeah. Thanks. We'll just it'll just be a little thing, but we'll stream it. Um, just change it up a little bit. Um, so yeah, guys. So this is Love Is All I Am. This is on Weightless Embrace Volume one online i don't have cds for it anymore but um, i would like to make some but they're just so expensive and god and uh i hate to say it like even though a lot of guys have bought my cd it's still f it's it's uh it's far as you need like hundreds and hundreds of people to buy cds to order a box of a thousand so i'm kind of i don't think i'm going to order i did think about reordering the weightless embraces again but I don't know. It's like, uh, it's just going the wayside. It's the new VHS, I guess. Um, or it's new DVD. 
All right, here we go. Thanks so much. Thanks to Karen, who's been, um, she's still listening to the end of it, but who sits here and writes all the stuff down so and then you all slip through the cracks. Though you still do, probably. All right, y'all. See you next week. Same time, same place, I guess. All right, oh, Kelly, good to see you on here, by the way. Thanks for the nice comments. Um, always great to see you. All right, bye everybody.